Spelling is so important. We want our kids to be good spellers. But spelling can be tedious and repetitive. Okay, so how do we do this? Here is your tip for today. Have your kids keep a journal. Each day as you start the school day or at the end of the day, whatever you want to do, tell them to get out their notebook, which is their journal book or their journal notebook, and write in there something about the day before. You can find lots of places with journal prompts, but writing about the day before is a quick and easy one. To say, hey, I want you to write at least three lines, five lines, whatever amount of lines you want to say about something that happened yesterday. They write this down. Now, as they're writing this down, you're going to not grade this. They're not going to correct this. If they ask you, how do I spell such and such? You can answer the question for them. Or you can say, how do you think you spell it? And they say, you know, H-O-U-S-E. That's, that's right. Yeah, you got it. So you knew they had to spell this the whole time. And then what you do is after they're done writing their journal entry, later on that day or that week, you look through it or you look over their shoulder as they're writing it and you see what words they've spelled wrong. Ooh, they spelled we went to the zoo and they spelled rhinoceros wrong. Okay, so mental note, rhinoceros need to add that to our spelling list. So you go ahead and make up the spelling list on your own. You can start out with your spelling list from a spelling program. You can go online and find a spelling list. You can make up a spelling list of some words you just think would be appropriate. And then what you do is in your everyday life, as you see them misspell a word, you don't need to go over there and circle it in red and make their journal look awful. It's their journal. They should just be journaling in there. Don't worry about it. But you keep mental note of the words that they've missed. Now you write those notes down somewhere else when they don't notice that you're looking over their shoulder and writing down words. Write down that word, make your spelling list. Easiest way to do the spelling list is to get this program. You just input your own spelling words. It will automatically um, put the definitions with it. It will automatically make games with it. And so you input the spelling words, you sit down one day and you say, okay, these are our spelling words for the day or for the week, you know, dog, D-O-G, dog, cat, C-A-T, cat, and your child writes them all down. Then the next day, or even that same day, you say, okay, it's spelling time. So I want you to spend 15 minutes on the computer playing this game. That counts as your spelling time. And you just make the time whatever you need it to be, whether it's five minutes, whether it's half an hour, whatever. And you go ahead and have this spelling list on this game. And for that week, they're practicing the spelling words through these games. At the end of the week, this program, and I'm sure other places do also, will give them a spelling test. So you can say, okay, today I need you to take the test. So all of a sudden they sit down and at their computer game, they're going to take the spelling test. So this is a quick, easy way to do spelling in a fun, interactive way. That way, if you're doing books for literature, workbooks, DVDs on, on the TV for math, whatever, this is something that's a break from the norm. You're going on the computer and it does all of your spelling words for you. Hope this helps. Remember to check out my Udemy course so you can get even more content. Hi and welcome to the Homeschool Master Course. My name is Marie and I've been homeschooling for 14 years. I've homeschooled special needs, different learning styles, both boys and girls, and we've also seen the results of homeschooling as we homeschooled from pre-K all the way to admittance into college. This is a master course, which means we're going to cover everything from looking into homeschooling all the way to admittance into college. We're going to learn about how to tailor some of the greatest curriculums to your child, how to identify their learning styles, and also the great impact you can have as a parent on your child's education. In this course, you'll gain confidence in your ability to homeschool, come up with great answers to the most difficult questions, see reviews of dozens of homeschool curriculum, understand the terminology used in the homeschool world. We're also going to talk about taking that curriculum and tailoring it toward your child and the way that they learn the best. Maybe you've been doing it for a while and you still feel a little lost. Well, this is a great course for you. Join this course today and the two of us will walk through homeschooling together. You're not in it alone and you're ready for a great adventure.